This thing, like, turned and that's why it's all fucked up. Day is going alright. Just playing some Chernobylite to, uh, to wind down for the day. Trying to push the main story. Thought I was about halfway through, but I guess not. Now that I've got uh, the entire team put together, I guess it's all about like collecting tools now. Uh, I'm just trying to gear up for the next uh, next mission. Uh, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I was making this. Uh, I guess... Can I put it in this corner? I can. Uh, and then the comfort's all jacked up. But it's fine, we just put some plants down. You know? A couple plants here and there. Makes everything good. Alright, so what does this take? Scatters light particles, uh, not the best armor, provides camouflage. Whereas this is excellent protection, inspired by Black Stalker technology. We have to be the Black Stalker. Like, it's gotta just be us. Too many things point to that. Okay. Inventory. Uh, let's get rid of... Oh, we don't have any lockpicks. There we go. Make three. Oh! That was my shoulder. Uh, put these away. I think we're good. Let's go ahead and sleep. Oh. Is it okay if I send you my portfolio on Discord for your email? I'm good on all on all the artwork stuff. I have I have two artists that I use constantly, so thank you though, Carms. I appreciate it. Uh, we're good. We're good. Igor, Igor, I've got to talk to you. Some serious shit is about to go down. What is it this time? One of the big fish is flying into Kapachi. We have a chance to intercept him. We have to act on this intel now. No problem, man. Good luck. Uh, how did you find out this information? How did you come to find out about this fish of yours? I've got a lot of contacts here, you know that. I usually try to keep a low profile, but an opportunity like this may not present itself again for quite a while. Well, this could be useful. It is 100% worth a shot. Imagine what kind of intel we can squeeze out of this guy. Squeeze. Just go over there and check it out for yourself, okay? I know a good vantage point. All right. But let's make one thing clear first. I'll do the talking. I've got a feeling this big fish might not survive your squeezing. Sure, sure. Whatever you say, boss. I'll mark the location on your map. Again, going back to Kopachi. You go to that place a lot. Uh, all right. Let's assign some missions, huh? So we'll be going to Kopachi. Oh, let's see here. Uh... Shashko can go get food. Olivier can go get ammo. Actually, Shashko can go get that. So 
so we shall do that. Nothing is ever as it seems with Mikhail, is it? What is he dragging you into this time? The NAR fish tank is a very murky and dirty place. Can you really tell the difference between a big fish and a bottom feeder when you meet them? Uh, I mean... Maybe. Pause right there. I will be right back, guys. I'll grab a drink. Un momento. Okay. We'll be back. Real question is who's on this map? Somebody at the center of this town, so that's what we're gonna follow. Uh, there's really nothing out here, huh? Oh, double enemies. I'm pretty sure that is the uh, the announcement that they played on the loudspeakers in, in Pripyat to evacuate the town. Pretty sure. Why does it still say there's something over here? Fence. Fancy shit, Captain. <sighs> it wants us to use the road. I don't want to use the road. I'm in position. How is this a good vantage point? No tower? No hill? Uh, right. Uh, you won't need a tower. There should be a control unit nearby. Find it and power it up. That is a rocket. Found it. What is this thing? Mikhail, what are you not telling me? And where is this big fish? He'll be flying over in a helicopter pretty soon. All you need to do is fire up the missile defense system. The rest is automated. 
Pretty fucking awesome, right? <laughs> it's old Soviet technology. This isn't interrogating somebody. This is just chance. murdering somebody. Don't tell me that's not a great fucking plan. What? You want me to shoot down a helicopter? Are you out of your goddamn mind? Oh, contraire, mon frere. It's the perfectly rational thing to do. Cut off as many of the Hydra's heads as you can! This is insane, Igor. You've no idea who's on board. I know we want to take down NAR, but blowing unidentified targets out of the sky is a war crime. This is fucking crazy! I am not going to shoot without knowing for certain who's on board that helicopter. It could be women and children for all we know. You've got to get your head straight, pal. Everyone here, everyone in that chopper, they're all NAR volunteers. Every one of them deserves to die for what they did to me and my friends! I don't know what you're talking about, and I'm not going to do it. It's over, Mikhail. You couldn't pull the trigger, huh? I knew it. Don't send a fucking pussy to do it. Oh, fuck! Accept it and move on. That's <laughs> not how we do things around here. You think you can tell me how we do things? My best buddies were slaughtered by these assholes. They tortured us. They clamped electrodes on my fucking nipples. Can you imagine what that's like, huh? Calm down, Mikhail. I want to get them as much as you, but not like this. I'm not going to fucking calm down. You robbed me of my revenge. You think you're something special, fucking egghead. Really, you're just a common thief. You are a major fucking disappointment, Igor. Guys, nuts. Interesting keeping trying to keep a balance on these guys. What the hell was that? I don't have time for cowards and pussies, which is what you are. Piss off! I know we have our differences, but you really ought to stay. I need you here. Damn right you do. Don't you ever forget that. All right, so next next mission we got it. We got to side with Mikhail. Nice. I didn't really bring back much. Nope. Give me that. Seeing as how I do not need metal plates. Um, and then all this revolver ammo I can go get rid of. Just like missing? No. The fuck is a random herb doing in there? Yeah, we can we can save that and wait. Uh 
What was I doing? Oh, that's right. I wanted to build a shotgun. Uh... This thing. Oh wow, I don't have enough flammable. Okay. Well shit. I have everything, I think we're good. This allows us to create gas masks, which I, I do not need. This would allow us to enter into the memory change, which we will probably eventually need. Weaponsmith, we have everything. Armorsmith, we have everything. Yeah, we're, we're, we are at the max here. Let's finally create this force field generator. Let's create a good amount of batteries. And that's what we'll equip. need the armor. This bro? No, we're, we're, we're not sending him out. We're sending the kid out. Where is he? Fuckface. Not Mikhail. Oh, we should start doing this a ton too. Who the fuck's the kid? Is he under the stairs? No. Oh, here he is. Do you have a moment, Igor? Sure. What do you need? I was wondering about that deranged old hobo I did the Duke a radar kick for. Tarakan? Yeah. Some of the things he said in passing makes me think there's more to him. More than a demented techno shaman with a knack for spy stuff and an unhealthy obsession with rats? Funny. But yes, I, I think he uses that stuff as a shell, into personal armor. There's something underneath all of that. When I was in Bujrakia prison, I met some guys doing time for political stuff. They told me how in the olden days, high-level, disloyal types were committed to a nut house. I mean, what's up with that, right? It had more to do with protecting the whole system than punishing one person. The people in charge wanted to send a message that it was insane not to believe the Soviet Union was the best country, or countries in the world. Yeah, insane. Did you know any rebels like that? I... I don't think so. Why? There was this rumor about someone, someone important, who was about to blow the whistle on the Duga project. He got chucked into the loony bin before he could speak up. Really? Who do you think it was? Beats me. The official reason was a mental breakdown after the Chernobyl disaster. Convenient timing, if you ask me. We probably won't ever know who it was. The bottomies and drugs will turn your brain to mush. I would like to redistribute our gear. Sure. Redistribute the shit out of it. Oh, he's already got attack armor. Okay, well, fuck. You don't need it. What about you? This world is doomed. Dial it down a notch. You... I can see us all in the devilish green swarm. Is the Red King? Is trying. So no... you make fun, Mouse? Tell me, do you fix it? You're talking about Chernobylite. <laughs> I'm not sure I follow. Why do you think the Red King, that because it's the who knows? Yes. Deserve to live. I've already heard this before. Remains. Pretty sure we have. Our relationship status with him is bad. Let me take a look at your gear. Of course, Mousy. Yeah, you have primitive armor. Okay, so we're gonna swap for attack, and then we'll just recycle the attack armor. Or sorry, the primitive armor. Okay, I now have. Th Three skill points that I can use? Hmm. 
We could do extra health. Wait, 18, that's 3, 6, 12. Oh, it is 18 left. Okay. Interesting. Um, damn, my relationship status is pretty bad with a few of them. Uh, let's see. I think I might do shotgun. No, we'll, we'll ignore... We'll ignore shotgun for now. Let's see if we can get the, the health bar increase. How are things, Professor? Hey. About what? I can show you a thing. There we go. Fantastic. Life on the streets taught me that quick reflexes can mean the difference between coming home and coming home in a box. Sometimes it can help you dodge a bullet. I mean, not literally, but you can remove yourself from harm's way. Let's see if I can teach you some new tricks, old dog. First, breathe from the bottom of your belly. Slowly flex that diaphragm. Feel the air filling you from your toes to the top of your head. Now, don't hold it. Just release it. Not too slow but not too fast either. Focus on your breathing and repeat the exercise three or four times. Okay, talk is cheap. I'm gonna fire the rubber bullets at you. You try to anticipate the shot and cover before you get hit. Oh, I cover. bet that hurt. It'll make you remember your training longer. Take cover, Igor. Ha, that was fast. You're pretty spry for an over-the-hill pre-perestroika scientist. Take cover, Igor! You're getting good at this. Take cover, Igor! Nice moves, old-timer. You still got it. Outstanding. You got the reflexes of a teenage gangbanger on Crystal. I take you into my crew. No questions asked. Is that a good thing? I don't know about that. <laughs> good to see you're still in shape. It'll come in handy. Nice. Good amount of health. Okay. I think we are good to go. Yeah, I'm still pretty, still pretty backed up on these. All right, well, chat room, that's gonna do it uh, for me for tonight. I'll go ahead and, and take care of a few things. Uh, try and get some sleep, as I have not slept in many, many days. Um, tomorrow we'll come back uh, to Chernobylite and continue on our, our sort of main quest. Um, or I should say story quest, because we don't really have a main quest. Uh, story quests here, just kind of knocking them out as they come. Damn, I just got here. I'm sorry, Jacob. I'm sorry. Um, but we'll be back tomorrow night, uh, and hopefully uh, by this weekend we'll be able to finish Chernobylite. Um, after Chernobylite, I don't really have a game lined up. Um, so if you know of one that maybe I'd be interested in, feel free to, uh, to, to drop it into Discord. Um, if not, we'll just jump back into Terra. Since I have a lot of fun with that game.